Okay, now let's check the theme of Beneath Oresa. A deck building rock like uh, game with an interesting art design. First of all, let me check the options here. Ball behind. Uh, let's go. Square in Widow. Yeah, way better now. I lower this. Yeah, I think we're okay now. Well, let's see how this game plays. Choose a plead. Since the gods abandon Oresa, House Agika, I guess that's how you pronounce that, received pleads from House who needs help in the city. Hmm. Now oh, that design uh, reminds me of some uh, comic books from uh, Moebius, a uh, famous uh, prince artist. Let's see, Vassal Envoy, no effect. Benevolent Cal, start with teamwork, uh, two teamwork level. On defeat, the hero cannot be played next lead. Starting deck is replaced by 15 cards among 40. Can all be accepted by Hectos. Okay, no effect. No Vassal Envoy. Oh, look at that. Choose a hero. So I have those. Oh, damn it, we cannot play here. Hectos. Oh. Let's see. Hectos is the patriarch of the house Akika de Faradi. He leads the life of quest and battle and wielding the oath. The sword descended from the heavens. A symbol of alliance between er Erath and house Akika. Centuries old, he knows secrets time forgotten. He's made alliances with centuries old entities and master frightening fighting techniques. 98 spin, let's see hero power. Blind Herald of Herat. Its first attack of the round against the foe grants 3 and 1. Okay, well, I guess we're gonna figure out what's that over there. A faction power counterattack. You have a charge meter. Each turn, two cards in your hand gain zeal for the turn. When discarding a zeal card instead of playing it, gain 2. Hmm. When it's turn, two cards in your hand gain zeal. When charge meter is full, automatically cancel and counter the next strongest, strongest melee attack. When counter attacking, deal damage equal to your retribution. Oh, and here we can see all the cards we can have on our deck. Oh. This is Nereide. Pierce and Bennett Nereide is the grand. Yeah, like Nereida? Is the granddaughter of Hectos and uh, heir to House Agica. In battle, she wields deliverance and ends and weapon belonging to a long forgotten civilization. And here we have Doltar. After the disappearance of Hectos Agica the third day, 20 years ago, his wife. Irsina took control of the house until her son Dollar came of age. Today he is the head of household and proved to be a magnanimous leader and fervent advocate of Erda's values. Uh -huh. Okay. As we can see, there are two more factions that we cannot play at the moment. Okay, let's start with this guy. Choose a companion. Oh, so we can get there like a companion. Okay. Let's see here. Oh, and here is all the map the map we have to explore. Choose a strategy. Observe. Gain one card among two. Gain one insector among three. Oh. So there is no tutorial there. Mm, let's go for that one. Choose a card in the discard return and reduce the cost by two. Uh, gain 2 and draw. Uh, let's get this one. Oh, look at that. Huh. Move in your zone. Move in your zone before attacking. Huh. Increase damage from attackers by this value per hit. Each round, this foe gains 3 for its ally nearby. Each time you attack this foe, it gains 5. 
Okay, let's see. Gain armor. Hmm. Okay, so he automatically goes on the on the guy with the less HP. Return one attack from your uh, discard pile, cost zero, gain one, smite. Okay, let's get this one and hit it again. Nice. Okay, we have one more mana to play. Uh, and pass the turn, I guess. Okay, interesting animations. Hmm, let's see. Hmm. So now we can return the card there. Choose a card in this card, return there, use the cost. But should I do that? No, oh, that. Is the deck uh, reshuffled uh, after we clear the room or? Uh... Hmm. Let's see, what can we return here? Ah, oh, fuck it, Let, let's uh, pass. Learning new techniques. Uh, passing next round, gain two. No, back on counter attack. This card gains five. Discard one random card, draw one. And we do 11 damage. Oh. Let's get that one. Mm, Scavage. Let's see. Choose a path. Gain one and the quorum among three. Uh, or we can heal and gain 10 max HP. I'm not sure what this uh, decorum is, so let's go for that one. Yeah, I like the presentation of this game. Now let's see, we have a choice here. Attack, this fight, discard one first round, better fight reward. Oh, let's go for that one. Okay. Mm. So he only attack this guy. I cannot change targets. Get one smite. Now, if I use this without any cards to discard, it does it activate? Let's give it a try. So, for example, we use that. Draw this one. 
Oh, yeah. So without the card to discard, we don't actually gain a card. Yeah, well, I had to check. Hmm, let's see. Zil passing. to escape mm. okay go again for one more attack and done let's see learn new techniques select one card uh 12 damage if you have a node amount of uh charge there the target suffers one yeah one debuff and no I'm not sure what's that we prevail when your charge meter changes gain three oh is this an artifact so is it always active oh my god look at that target gains reconstruction five authorizing slash that's a lot of damage but i think i'm gonna get this one this is a new category i don't have any other thing like that I want to see if that's an active uh, effect on the on the battleground. Increase teamwork by one, upgrade one card, remove one. Oh. Okay, let's improve one card there. Okay, we can make this thing uh, do double damage. Hmm. Improve the armor more. Oh, a knockback. What should we improve here? Hmm. I think I'm gonna go for this so I have a. Oh, look. Wait a minute. 15 discard one, run, draw one. If the discard card has no zeal, gain one smite. If the, the drone card is maneuver, gain one smite. I think I'm gonna go for this one. I want to have a zero card that does 12 damage. Besides, we're still learning the mechanics of this game. Let's see. Attack. This fight is random, four gains, two. This fight, 50% chance you gain one. Oh, so we can go with no effect or uh, we can give a debuff on the random foe. But it has a 5% chance we have this debuff. Yeah, let's go like that. Oh, look at that. The wolf within. At timber unless or feed the wolf in your hand. Oh. Lose 2 HP, draw 1, gain a copy of this card. Each round gain one smite. Hmm. Okay, now let's see. I think I can kill them both. Go over that and almost got him down. Oh, he's charging. Oh, did he steal a card from me? If 
How can I change targets? I want to kill this guy. Okay, we have a billion smites now. This is your task. It's time you change zone, gain four, next round gain two and two cards. Oh. Sanctified Smite. It's time you play Smite. This card damage increased by three until it's played. Oh. Huh. Well, let's see. Hmm. Okay, let's get this one. Okay. Teamwork perks. Let's see, upgrade one card, heal 30% of your hit points. Increase teamwork by one. Each fight heal 5 HP. Uh, we have 51. Hmm. Well, 5 after each fight is pretty decent, but we already own half HP. I think I'm gonna heal up. Choose a path. Oh, we cannot get this one. Gain one card among six. <laughs> among six. Gain one rare card. A bad one card among six. Okay. Uh, let's see. This is pretty decent. Gain one, gain uh, armor equal to twice your charge meter. Hmm. Gain one smite and a copy of this card. Okay. And let's upgrade one card here. I think I'm gonna upgrade one of those attacks here. Plus we have a knockback effect. I uh, think I'm gonna increase my charge here. I'm gonna go for this one. Hmm. Let's see, can we actually hopefully the run? It will be fun. Okay, we're about to fight. Uh, better fight reward this fight a random four gains 20 HP max. Okay, let's go for the challenge. Okay, let's plan this thing. Again, one smite on counter attack. Okay, this one gonna use later. Come on, dude, he's almost them. Nice, now next round we gain two cards. Hmm.
let's see. Oh, damn you. Oh, look at that. The discard is discarded at the end of your turn. Add the copy to your discard pile. Uh, let's see. When your charge meter changes, gain three. Okay, now. Okay, we're gonna smite. Now let's see, get this thing on. Uh, lose two HP, draw one card, gain a copy of this card. To smite. Now let's go, go for that. Oh, we're on max, uh, max armor, I guess. Oh, so we can keep using my armor and get more, uh, more uh, cards. Uh, let's go. Yeah, I think we're gonna stay here. If this card is discarded, add the copy to your discard pile. Okay, I think we have a billion armor now. Uh, let's see, what the fuck is this doing? Okay, all my charges are now up. Now oh, what? It's turn two cards on your hand gain zeal. When discarding a zeal card instead of playing it, gain two. When a charge meter is full, automatically cancel and counter the next strongest melee attack. Oh, okay, I see. Uh, let's go. Okay, well, we took a lot of damage with this. Uh, let's see, short lived grace. Gain three mana, one card. Uh, suffer the opposite or next. Swift rectifi uh, rectification knockback. If you have a not amount of uh, charge, gain one smite. When the route starts, if this card is on this card pile and you have zero, return it. Huh. Uh, let's go for this one. Gain three. So you gain a lot of them, now the next round you lose. Okay, let's get this one. Uh, let's see, heal up, teamwork. Uh, well, I still want to heal up myself, to be honest. Where is the next resting spot? More danes are better, breeds, scavets. Oh, yeah, it will be. Mm. Well, uh, damn it. I should have upgraded my. my. Fuck, okay, let's go. Upgrade the teamwork. Even if we die, let's go. Uh, the fight gain one first round attack charge okay let's 
let's go. Here. When you search meter, change this gain three. Uh, so let's use this one on that target. Yeah. I have to be more careful with my armor there now. Okay, now let's go with that one, this one, get some armor and pass. Oh, come on, how many times this guy attacks? Let's see, you lose one, throw three. That's pretty cool. Discard your hand, draw as many cards as your chart meter. After the attack, if you are alone in your zone, draw one. Hmm. Well, all most of them are pretty cool. Knockback, so I can throw them out of the zone. Hmm. Let's see, I think I'm gonna go for this one. Three cards with one and a minor drawback. Uh, oh my god, look at that. Well, upgrade one card amongst... Uh, let's see... I think I'm gonna upgrade one of these things too that give me armor. Let's see again when we manage to finish this thing. This fight, 70% chance to gain or 35% chance to discard the card at fight start. Huh. Well, fuck it, uh, we're almost dead anyway. Oh, damn, this is a boss fight, I guess. Can we return the card? Uh, 
I'm gonna die like a little bitch. Oh my god. Come on, do a counter attack there, this fucker. If this card is discarded at the end of your turn, lose 8. So I have to use it or I'm gonna lose 8 points of life. Oh, amazing. I'm gonna survive this thing, damn you! Uh, let's see here. Now I'm gonna get 8 points of damage and then I'm gonna die. Oh no! Oh, nice, we gain one round. Oh my god. Stun. Fleeting, what the hell is that? And I hear that there is no help on this game. I want to see what this thing does. Are we gonna be stunned next time round? That's the, the thing there. Again to smite. It's round again. Uh, let's go for that one. Go so, smite the shit out of this guy. Oh, survive it! Gonna be stunned next round. Oh my god! No! Oh my god. Hey, well, we, for th the first run in this game, without any tutorial, I think we did great. Now, is there actually resources, how to play, how to target? One rule you always target a foe. If there is more than one, is the one outlined in white. To browse uh, through the foes, use the mouse wheel. Oh, okay. Zones. There are two zones. How to change zone. Counter attack. It's round and your turn with Zeal cards in hand to fill your charge meter. Its Zeal card discarded gives you two charges. When fully charged, the next strongest melee attack targeting you is countered, inflicting retribution damage to the attacker. Oh, yeah, I know about this mechanic, but I didn't manage to use it. Each round, two cards at random in your hand receive Zeal, a card with Zeal that's not played and has discarded at the end of your turn. Uh, grants two. Hmm. Uh, fury, deal the additional damage equal to your fury. If the icon is blue, the fury is temporary. Fragile, any damage applied to the target of Fragile is increased by equal amount. 
Okay. The icon is blue, the fragile is temporary. Okay, guard, prevent the amount of damage equal to the value. Okay. Retribution, when a counter attack is triggered, the foe whose attack is counter suffers damage equal to the retribution. Reconstruction, each round heal for the current value, then reduce it by one. Hmm. This card is removed from the fight if it's either played or in your hand at the end of the turn. Uh, this card is not discarded. Uh, okay. Action, aim, pause, aim, deal 50% more damage. Yeah, I hope that I really wanted the menu that appears on the when we play that have all this information. Okay, I think I'm gonna go for one more fast run here before we go on the next demo. This fight pose heal 3 HP each round. When you choose a card to discard or turn and reduce its cost by 2. Okay. Now, oh, can I cancel? Now let's discard this one and gain some uh, zeal. Okay, okay, nice. Oh no, I should have gone for that guy. Let's see. Uh. Okay, now let's see. Now, supposedly now I'm gonna counter attack his uh, his thing there. I'm gonna. Oh, fuck, let's kill. Uh, if the target is far, gain one. Twenty. Oh my god. If you have three or less, uh, draw one card, gain twenty and one. Hmm. Scavets. Mm, Ten max HP. Let's see what is this uh, at the forum? Uh, it's fight the first time a fox while you're at 20 HP or less, gain 40. Oh. Okay. 
so this is like an uh, artifact that we have always uh, on. Give me a second. Sorry. And increase teamwork or gain a decorum and upgrade one. Yeah, let's go for another decorum. Each time the attack is shuffled, gain 25. Nice. And let's upgrade one card. Okay, okay, we're starting to get the hang out of this. Uh, this fight, gain one and one card first round, gain one card among two. Okay, let's start with this guy. Look at that. I think I'm gonna discard all of these things. I'm gonna get this card. And I'm gonna attack this guy. See, it's around if your HP are lower than your rates, your charges or whatever. Gain 6 until the end of round. Hmm. Hmm. Look at this thing. Uh, well, that's pretty decent damage though. Fuck it, let's go with that one. Okay, here we can rest. Uh, I think I'm gonna improve my team teamwork. Let's go for teamwork now since we're at the beginning of the dance room. Gain one card and ball, gain one insector among three. Go for that. Discard your hand, then draw your hand plus two. Draw two cards, erase a card from your hand. Gain two mana on draw draw one. Oh, so instead of the normal, we gain one. So if we use this like the last card, we're probably gonna draw two. Hmm. Let's go for that one. Let's see. This card back. Damn you.
go this. Let's kill this guy. Nice. When a foe is destroyed, gain eight, arm eight armor. Oh, nice. Now oh, this is pretty decent. On counter attack, this card gains five damage. Hmm. This will be nice on the rooms with a lot of enemies. Remove one card for your deck. Add two infinite cycle to your deck. Or decrease teamwork. Yeah, fuck, let's cover that one. Uh, we should remove. What should we remove here? Now yeah, let's cover one parade. Uh, this fight around on four gains. This fight 50%. We gain this thing. Yeah, fuck it, let's go. Okay. Nice, I like how we start with this super combo here. Uh, let's see. Wendy. Mm, let's go with that one. <laughs> nice. By the way, gonna take damage now. Yeah. The motherfucker. Oh. Let's get this thing. And fuck you. Hmm. Next round, gain two and two. I like this and I like this thing. Now, this is a lot of uh, burst damage. Yeah, fuck it. Let's get that one. Okay, now we really need to heal up here. Can we choose where to go? Yeah, let's go here. There. Go to... Okay. Mm, let's start with this thing. Come on, that fucker. Absorb the damage, nice. Fuck you. Uh, let's see, another sinful strike or knockback if you have a node amount the target gains. Huh.
Okay, let's get this thing. Oh, nice. Increase teamwork and upgrade one card, finally. Uh, let's see, what can we do on these cards? If the target is far, gain one. If your HP are below your charge, gain one spite. Another four heals. Another four heals, gain five. Now this is pretty decent, if I upgrade it we can uh, get a card back from our pile and uh, reduce the cost by 2. Now this thing is a really good, uh, oh we can reduce the cost to 0, we're gonna leave the cost on 1 and gain 12 instead of 8. Huh. I think I'm gonna go with this one, so we can have even more burst damage on the round. Kill 10 HP or go for the plus whatever. More danger, better rewards. Yeah, let's go up there and kill. Now look at that. Uh, I think I'm gonna go on that guy. didn't get a smite there. Hmm. Ah, damn. Almost got him. Ah, damn it. Okay, now we can do this. Uh, let's see. Go for one spike on this guy. And bye bye, guys. Uh, when your chest meter changes, game three. Uh, gain one decorum, remove one card from your deck, decrease teamwork. Oh, for fuck's sake. I would like that decorum, but I don't know what to do that. Uh, each time your chain zone, gain four. Target gain the reconstruction five. I want to check what this does. Okay, nice. Now we can upgrade one. Mm, let's see. I think I should increase my damage there. Even though more armor might be better so we can become more defensive. Hmm. I think we have enough damage, let's go for that one. Uh, let's see. Uh, for la familia. Well, I really, I really want to improve my teamwork, but uh, we need HP, so kill up. Oh, look at that. With a... 
Let's get an Insector here. Reduce the cost of each card in your hand by one until the end of your round. Gain one. Oh my god, this is amazing. Now, in, with this stand, we can improve uh, our damage output by a lot, but this thing is pretty decent too. Uh, fuck it, let's get the third next card. Cancel the next attack against them. Oh my fucking god, they, they, they didn't have this thing there. Now let's see what we can do. We can do this, get this thing again. Now let's target that guy so we can get one more mana. Nice. Now let's see what is this ability. At the end of the turn, heal 5 equal to this value and reduce the construction by 1. Huh. I should have increased my armor to be honest. Oh, so the block is removed after they actually uh, do damage to me. Okay. Now each time you play an attack this round, gain 8. Oh, let's go! Yeah, look at that. Gain 2 smite. Oh, now let's be careful here. Let's do this properly. Okay, let's start. Okay, now let's target that guy. Start with this uh, that gives healing. Uh, let's go over to this thing there. Uh, well, I have a billion armor now. I think we're okay. Yeah, let's go like that. Nice, nice. Go. Gain one smite on thunder attack. Let's see. Yeah, we started to get the hang of this thing. And bye bye. Oh, yeah, this fucker hit the seal on. Okay, nice. Let's see. 
select one and decorum. During the first round, each time you play maneuver or a program, gain one. When the fight starts, a random attack in your deck deals 20 extra damage until played. Oh. Each fight the first time a foe is destroyed, gain 5 reconstruction. Let's say during the first round, each time you play maneuver or program, draw 1. Uh, let's go for that one. I'm not sure if that was the best uh, selection, but hey. Oh, <laughs> look at that, we actually finished our run. Nice. Beneath Oresa, there will be much more to discover in the depths of Oresa. All release includes all three chapters and boss battles, new playable factions and companions, more unique foes with their own tactics, daily missions and other game modes, plus even more features to come. Nice. Well, that was a pretty decent uh, rock-like uh, card game there. Yeah, with uh, those deck building abilities. That was Beneath Oresa, and I really like the art style. Uh, it really reminds me the art uh, of Moebius, that uh, famous uh, Ferenc artist. Yep, uh, and I like the combination of a uh, sci-fi with fantasy elements here. So if you like a game like this one, go check it yourself. <laughs> yeah, you can find it on Steam.